Matt Wolders here at Wolders Boats, introducing you to a new little boat that we're offering. This is called the Super Cub. It's a 13 and a half foot boat. What we're targeting here is the smaller, riveted, John boat type application, giving someone that size, but beefing it up, making it tough, more work boat worthy. All right? So some of the neat things about this boat, it's 160 thousandths haul, 13 and a half foot long, as I mentioned before. The side height is 28 inch high. It's got the reinforced chines down below, a rub strip right here on the gunnel. This boat's fully powder coated. We offer it powder coat or non-powder coated. I'm gonna take a closer look at the inside. So there you are from above, seeing a better view inside. Again, what is so neat about this boat is it's small at 13 and a half feet long, but it's so beamy with six and a half foot wide beam. Here's the neat thing about being that length. It doesn't take up a lot of space on a larger boat's deck for storage, but look how much useful space is down on the inside. So with those higher 28 inch high sides, again, the six and a half foot wide beam, no benches you have to step over going forward, tons of workspace. This boat's actually going to Bristol Bay, Alaska to be a tender for a larger boat. What they also asked for is room to put pallets inside. So we're hauling pallets from here to there. We, it's designed with the benches running full length for easy access forward and back, but also set a pallet here. You can set a pallet up on the front deck as well. Storage under the benches and up in the front. So plenty of storage, some grab handles if you want. All right, now you got another perspective. Again, another thing I love about this boat, standing and running is nice and easy. I like the comfort of the side benches while running, whether on one side or the other. This boat also will come standard with a splash well, which you don't see in this particular model, but it'll have a splash well. This is a large storage area for your jerry cans and other supplies. And we have a welded floor down below. You can leave it bare aluminum or cover it with a mat like you see here.